first on foot, then on hand cars, and finally aboard a second locomotive, the Texas. Sixty years later, silent comedian Buster Keaton recreated this true life adventure. Keaton himself loved trains from full size to scale models and made sure his recreations of the Texas and the General were accurate. The comedy, of course, was 100% Keaton. When this picture was made in 1926, there were plenty of old steam engines. No one gave it a second thought to destroy one in the process of filming a big action scene. <laughs> 